to another video. Today we're going to be looking at the Hebco and Beckett tail rack for the KTM 390 Adventure, which I think is the best tail rack for this motorcycle. So now here is the rack in question. It is extremely strong and bolts to the frame. So what it actually does is it winds up making your subframe quite a bit stronger. If you look at the angle that we got it out of here, we bolt just under the handrail over there, over there, and then it bolts just above your foot peg over here. And what this does is it actually gives quite a bit more structural rigidity, making it a lot stronger. So when you ride the bike, you actually do not feel the pannier bags moving at all, and they stay firmly in place. Also over here, this is an aftermarket exhaust. The normal exhaust is a little bit longer, but even with this one being a little bit shorter, my pannier bags did not get damaged at all. Looking at the darker side, you can also see that the rail runs all the way around the other side under the motorcycle and it's so strong that you can actually stand on it. Not that our very good balance or that your alarms are supposed to do this, but you can actually put all of your weight on these and they are completely stable. I'm not hearing any creaking, no issues whatsoever and I'm a professional mechanic and I installed these myself. Uh, so now that we can see how strong they are, how well do they fit? So. These are bags we're going to be reviewing a little bit later. There's a link in the description for these bad boys. If you, could, if you do plan on buying these, please buy them through the link in the description. That would support my channel a lot. So they fit quite well, quite comfortable. They follow the whole size of the bag. These are 30 or 35 litre bags, and they fit quite comfortably. Now, because I haven't bought the tail rack at the back, they sort of do have the potential of slipping off over here. But nothing, tires can't fix, and I should be replacing these bad boys pretty soon. But I do not notice the weight of these at all and I've got a full tool, tool kit with spare tires and compressors and all the things in the side and it's like they're not even there. Looking down the side you can see that the bags may lean against the exhaust a tiny little bit but um, you just need to set them higher. At the moment my exhaust quite nice with that did sort of seep over and it didn't burn it at all and they have been running flawlessly ever since. So folks that's my review of these, I really like them, I'm happy with them, I would not put anything else on this. It actually makes the bike a little bit stronger and if you do go over they actually do work as crash bars as well. If you like the video please like and subscribe and do all the things. Um, I will be posting at the end of this video adventures that I have taken them on and you can see sort of how they work, how they haven't worked. I'll be releasing a review of these bags as well. I just want to test them a little bit more and see that they actually work and take them off road. But please like and subscribe and do all the things. And remember folks, if you're stuck in a road, try something new, do something old, do something now. Cheers, bye.